Welcome to quantitative reasoning solution section and today we have quantitative reasoning from Lantern Step Book 4, page 19. Thank you for joining in today and to our new viewers, kindly subscribe to this channel for more quantitative reasoning solutions and mathematics problems. And to our subscribers, thank you for staying with us. Alright, so this is book 4 of Lantern Step page 19 and we have this example we have 2 3 16 5 2 and here we have 3 1 5 1 and 2 and for this example we have 5 4 30 5 and 2 all right we're going to solve uh these and different parts to know what to do all right so don't forget to like subscribe leave a comment say thank you to us share with other parents and teachers okay let's go to it so let's start with the middle number to find 16. so for 16 we're going to have Five squared here plus two squared, right? So that gives us 25 plus four. Five squared is 25, and two squared is four. When we add them, we have 29, right? So this is more like an, a first equation. So then we're going to go ahead to have. 2 squared, that's this, is 4. 2 squared plus 3 squared. 2 squared plus 3 squared gives us 4 plus 9, right? And that gives us 13. So we're going to have 29 here minus 13. That gives us 16. Okay, so to find 5, right, this one. We'll have 3 here squared plus 2 squared. That gives us 3 squared is 9 plus 2 squared. We have 4, right? We have uh, 13, okay? So 13 minus this 2 squared, that gives us 13 minus 4. And 13 minus 4 is 9, all right? So 16, this number, minus this 9, we have sorry, 16 plus 9, that gives us 25. Right, so square root of 25, you have your 5, right? So the next we have, so to find 3, there's 3, right? So we're going to have 5 squared plus 5 squared plus 2 squared. So 5 squared plus 2 squared, that gives us 25 plus 4, okay? We have our 29. So 29 minus the part narrow of the 3 we are looking for, that's this 2. 2 squared. So we have 29 minus 2 squared is 4. So 29 minus 4, we have our 25. So 25 minus... 16 here minus 16 we have our 9 hence square root of 9 that gives us 3 okay so let's use this space we're still on this example so to find 2 let's find this 2 down so we're not working on this example we're still here 2 down right 
So we have 5 squared plus 2 squared. That gives us 25 plus 4 equals 29. So 29 minus 3 squared. So 29 minus 3 squared, we have 9, right? And 29 minus 9 is 20. So 20 minus 16, minus 16, that gives us 4, right? So square root of 4 is 2. So that's how we got the 2 here. Next, to find 2, this 2 up here. This two, two up, right? So to find two, we're going to have, so let's have three squared plus two squared. Okay, so three squared is nine and two squared is four. And that gives us 13. And we have our five squared, this five squared is 25. So we're going to have 25 minus this 13 we have our 12 right so 16 minus this 16 here minus 12 that gives us 4 hence square root of 4 would give us our 2 all right so that is it for this so if you try the same method with these examples you will definitely get the same answer and those of you asking for the samples uh this is a complete guide to solving all the exercises given all right so don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel for more quantitative reasoning solutions and mathematics problems bye